Howdy, howdy, everybody. Good morning. We're getting ready to head over to that estate sale we went to yesterday on the wrong day. It's currently 7-12, so we should get there. We got to stop, get gas, pull out some cash, and we should make it there right when they open, hopefully. So y'all come along with us on that ride, and let's hopefully find some good stuff. That's what we do when we're waiting on the estate sale to open. Just sit here editing video. Got to get ahead of the game. What is this joker? What is that you found? Man, what is that? Buy that joker. Dead ahead. <laughs> Somebody break something. See this thing of matches, matchbooks. What is this? Mm -hmm. They're little books. They look like tracks. Like um, gospel tracks, religion tracks. I like yours. They don't keep video games in the kitchen. I'm just throwing that one out there. What is this for three out? Is that a pencil sharpener? Mm -hmm. And that joker's heavy. all over here. For these match boots. Since we're getting the rest of them. <laughs> this was 15. Just do that together. Yeah. Okay. Thank you. Hold on. I see something over here I want to look at. Yeah, you won't have it. <coughs> no way. You can. probably get it cheap. I couldn't. I, I couldn't handle it. I don't drink red right bite. It takes balls of steel to handle that stuff, and I don't have it. I bet these right here kill some junk. That back one bombs are good. And I don't want. I ain't into buying towels at the yard sale. I mean. You ain't using them. You just wash them, dry your hands on them. What is that? Look, there's your toilet. What is that? What is this place? Are you shy? Is this the bathroom? Laundry room. I got a toilet in the main house. That's something. I don't know if you can use that. I'd use it. That 
jelly one's pretty good. You ain't got that Rona, do you? No. <laughs> I hope you ain't. Breathing through these things. Drives me nuts. I think she's got the Rona. I'm ready. Right. Leave, leave, leave. Yep, I'm ready. Pop that open. Ain't fan. I wonder how much is this. How about three? Let me get a sticker because I don't. How much is these couplings and stuff? Okay. All of them. All of them. All of them. All of them. How about everything? Everything right here. Everything right there. And the box. You gonna coat that in banana? Forty dollars. Box and all. How about thirty? How about thirty-five? And you got it. That sounds like a winner. Ring me up. There's probably some good <laughs> cuff links and stuff in there. Okay. Yeah, all that'll close up in there. Probably not. Oh, yeah. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. Yeah. All right. What's that, man? You all right? Doing good. Doing good. Good. I'll be doing a lot better when I get out this mask. <laughs> I ain't going to lie. That's why I'm outside. <laughs> I, don't blame you. I try to stay outside. What we got? 35, 38. And this is 15 with the rest of the MacBooks. Yeah, she said throw them in because there are MacBooks inside of here. Oh, okay. All right. And um, I did this one. This just got the yellow sticker on it. Let me go ask. Yeah, her. need to ask them. Let them put I'll a price on it. We got 53. This didn't have no price on it. We're gonna go a dollar on that. I figure that's when bug bombs used to be good. Nowadays, them jokers won't kill nothing. Um, got a book. Okay. I'll let you just look through that. Uh, 79. Don't have a price on it? Mm-mm. Okay. We had two things that didn't have a price on the book and that. And 79. This is 20. No, uh, the books, the books are a dollar for the soft oh, okay. covers. Oh, okay. Yeah, they got the big sign. And even. What about this? Even hundred. Even hundred. Yeah. Let's see. 20, 40, 60, 80, 1. And the box. Right there in the box. Man, y'all got it set up good. Let me count That's it again to be sure. Now, he, One, he don't want to touch two, anything, right? Three, four, five. That's us. We're good to go. We're awesome, man. Buddy, it's going to be hot again today. I'm ready for winter. Mm -hmm. Alrighty guys and gals, I need to preface what y'all are about to witness here. So this was yesterday. We done been back over for a third time. Y'all see that stuff back over there? So we went back to the state sale for the second time yesterday because whenever I was editing the video y'all previously watched, I noticed some Marlboro hats. Well, Courtney noticed them at the sale and I told her I wasn't interested. And then I looked them up, you know, that evening and realized I should have been interested. And Courtney, we had a mission when we got there. We were supposed to go straight to them hats. You know what I mean? Just straight to them. We had this mission. Well, as soon as we hit that door and I felt that air conditioner, I seen a squirrel run off to my right. And I said, hang on, because I got distracted. And y'all watch Courtney, buddy. She held the course. I mean, she didn't look at anything. Well, we done been there one straight, time and ain't like straight to changed. them jokers. I don't know what I was downstairs messing with. Ain't no telling what I was looking at. Probably just like a. I don't know. I completely left you and just took out. I don't know. I don't have no idea. Anyhow, she got the things, but y'all about to see that. But watch how fast she makes it up there. Man, it feels good in here. Mm -hmm. <laughs>
box in the end. Yeah. Do you want them? Are these rain jackets? Yeah. Grab that. Let's take this stuff down. Well, this ain't heavy compared to that. Oh, we got the bag too, don't forget. Okay. Alrighty guys and gals, so we are back at the shop here. It is a different day. Um, we went back over to that estate sale where y'all seen previously on the last video again a couple of different times actually and picked up some more stuff. So we're going to do the haul from the first time we went there and then we're going to do a haul from the estate sale you just watched and then from the second time we went there we got all kinds of stuff up here though not all this stuff came from there but y'all see that in a future video so i'm gonna do my best to remember what's what before we get started though i'm gonna tell you to the first redneck who ever bowled a peanut god bless that man so gross i mean i want to shake his hand i've been over here see these jokers buddy we've been over here just eating these jokers no 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 you've been eating them i'm gonna tell you the juice it's just as good as the nut itself. Like the water, I'd bathe in it if I could. You were so gross. Tastes <laughs> like a pinto to me. Yeah, Courtney said it tastes like a pinto. Or maybe just because my taste buds are off. Bless her heart. So we're going to have to, y'all, we're going to have to do this quick. Um, what the heck was that? National Lampoon Sled. Take this puppy up for five bucks. I'm going to use this and get Courtney tied up behind the car and I'm going to go sledding. I just got it because it's just like the one off National Lampoons. Picked up this Luke Bryan, that's my kind of night tour 2014 bracelet. Why'd we buy that? It's only two dollars. Two bucks. Got some vintage drawers. Got these two pairs of boxers. Um, dollar a piece. At that same sale, we got this NIV Pastor's Bible. The comps on this was great, actually. I listed this year, actually, like 160 bucks. Who would have thought? This new American Standard Bible, it's brand new. Paid five a piece on these Bibles. Like I say, if they good stuff at the estate sale, don't want past it. I listed this yesterday and within three minutes, it sold for 47.50 plus shipping. I um, picked this up, it's a Magnavox black and white television and it's basically new, don't, I mean, in excellent condition. With the box, paid 20 for it. I think I can get about 60 to 75 plus shipping. I hate when they do this. It's this like the third thing they did it to. They write in Sharpie on the cardboard. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to write more numbers around it so it don't like a price. Or just take it, a black Sharpie and scribble yeah. over it. But if I put like a 5, 4, 3, 8, and then maybe another number there, they'll never know if it's price unless they go back and watch this video. Here's these Hang soaps. On. Hang on. We running out of room. Here's these soaps. These are Jergens medicated clear complexion complexion bars. And these are new old stock. 50 cent a piece on them. Once again, they wrote on cardboard. Got this Duraband AM FM Sports Radio new in a pack. I don't know. This is four bucks. This is a memory lane. Share your thoughts and memories with those you love. It's got like a VCR tape and stuff. I don't know. New seal. Yep. Got this thing right here called Perry Stone Prophecy Collection. Yeah, this was five DVDs. They're new sealed. Got this Sony flat black and white TV FM stereo receiver FD 45A. Paid 12 for it. Where's the price? Right there. 
So that one sells pretty good. Um, picked up this backgammon set for 10. Y'all would have seen that in the first video. So I ain't gonna open it again. And my favorite, buddy, if that don't scream, I'm haunted. There ain't nothing in this world that screams it more than this right here. It's a shadow box and that little joker's pinned up in there. I paid $35 for it. I think I can get 100 115 It's creepy. Probably about 115 Later on, y'all would have seen we went back in that video that said I bought this chair here. It's heavy. It's brand new. It's um Coca-Cola chair. That's who it was shipped to, Coca-Cola. So I'm going to open it up to see if it's got like a Coca-Cola design on it. But it's brand new, so it'll still be new open box. I paid 30 $32, I think, for it. I think I can get somewhere in the neighborhood of 150 to 200 for it, though, if it's Coca-Cola. I don't know. Well, I don't know neither, but I bought it. Y'all come here with me. The Marlboro Racing Team Caps. And these things, new in the box, I think I can get about 30 for average between 35 to 45 dollars a piece for plus shipping so we got a bunch of them i bought every one of them paid four bucks a piece on them we also got these these were a buck a piece just little keychains and stuff pick them up too i done listed that stuff but i figured i'd show it to you guys and gals anyway and then at the estate sale the estate sale y'all just watched y'all seen me pick these up and you, i thought they was expired and um i picked this one up and it expired in 420 so i just kind of put them all back well courtney went back in there and looked and these ain't expired yet that don't expire till october and these sell pretty good so we got them listed already these were two bucks a piece I picked this right here up. Pro Retinol 100% Vegetal plus Enzymes. I ain't even gonna try that word. Digenusia. New sealed. But got this Krauss ink pen. I don't know if it's worth anything. I paid three bucks for it. You'll see that there. It's fancy. It is. I remember growing up, my dad had one in this case like this. Picked up this little hymnal book. Little church hymnal. Well, isn't that just cute? I didn't even know you picked it up. Sure did. I don't know what year it is. I got that. I've seen these. They didn't have a price on them. The guy said four bucks after I went out there to pay, so I, I couldn't grab them things up fast enough. That don't even go in there. What is that? That ain't. So you just basically paid $4 for the case case. I think I can sell it separate. But these are case knives. It's missing one. I didn't know that. But what I'm going to do is I'm going to separate them. I'll sell them individually. That's a case, double X knife. And then I'll sell this case, this separate and the three knives separate, what I'll do. Four bucks, I mean, you can't go wrong with that. And then I picked these up. It's just a lot of matchbooks. I paid $15 for this. But these will do all right. I mean, there's probably some pretty good ones in here. The advertisement on them makes make some good look here to old Shawnee's. But I ain't gonna lie. And, oh, and she gave me all these too included in it the reason i bought these is i figure these jokers right here all i gotta do is make one listing okay take a picture of each one and then just change the title so i can knock them out quick 21 ain't gonna be nothing um pick this right here up this 20 bucks what i get for this joker it's heavy it's iron and it's got some markings on it, it says japan and then got some kind of korean writing I guess that's Japanese writing since it's from Japan, ain't it? I would assume, yes. But that joker right there, I bet that thing weighs 12 pounds. I mean, it's heavy. It's a stallion. I hope I can sell it for more than 20. Uh, this just, a, I think it's a Panasonic. Yep, Panasonic pencil sharpener electric, three bucks. Got some bug bombs. So this right here, I paid $35 for it, okay? And um, Gulf Shores, a little knife. But it's got these watches in here. Buddy, that right there looks fancy, don't it? Mm hmm Them watches. And these are all, well, mainly all cufflinks. See this? If you leave them on these cards, it makes them look cheap. I'm going to take them off the cards and sell them. I think I can get They're more money. There's a lot of them things in there. See this stuff? What is that? I don't know. We can go through it more. Than yeah, I bought that. Thirty-five dollar. Don't say no. Alrighty, guys and gals. So, y'all bear with me here. 
I'm on the phone, so I apologize. I'm over here listing these cufflinks, see them? And I realized, I thought these were like some Chinese, like a bunch of them just on a little card. He made these cards, okay? Uh, them right there are gold, okay? Yeah, gold field. She found, these are all sterling silver right here. These three. And see that marked sterling on the back of them? But we haven't looked. We haven't looked at any more of them. So these things may be pretty good, man. I thought these were some Chinese junk. But we just had to share that with you guys and gals. Who would have thought? All this stuff came from a different sale. Y'all gonna see that next video. I think that's everything. And um, this stuff's gonna, y'all see that next haul. But look, row tide. Old Mark Ingram. Buddy, that guy could run right there. I got that for my brother. Got the certificate of authenticity. But y'all gonna see that stuff later. So just a teaser for you guys and gals. This ain't no wild animal. If y'all enjoyed this video, be sure to hit that thumbs up button for us. And if you haven't already, subscribe to the channel. Hit the bell notification. All you guys are awesome. And it is hot in here. I got some peanuts calling my name. So I'm going to get over here eat some peanuts. It's currently Saturday afternoon. I still got to do my 21 listings. We've been on trek so far. So we ain't got long left in this challenge. Thank goodness. So we'll catch up with y'all on the next video. See y'all.